Our people are not going to be able to believe it. They're not going to be, they're going to be lost for words, man, when this place gets taken down, man. Bro. Any kingdom, any kingdom, what happened before the kingdom got taken down? The men went out there prophesied and what happened in Egypt? Did the Lord not take down Pharaoh? That's right. That's right. right. Did the Lord not take down Sodom and Gomorrah? That's right. You can search up in Google. The pillow of salt is still there today to remember what? Remember Lot's wife and look back. Hey, we're not looking back in this wicked place, man. Uh, that's we're right. damn about this place, man. Every day we wake up, man, working for what heathen, man. Persians and Emis, man. That's right. John 14 and 15. Bring it up. If you love me. If you are. If, if you, you love me. So if you love the Lord, let's, let's find out what he said. Read. Keep my commandments. Keep my what? Keep my commandments. Keep my what? Keep my commandments. You have to keep the commandments of the Lord, man. Right. There's the Christian church said the Lord's done away with. The Lord's not done away with, man. You still have to keep your beard in your face. Women still have to wear dresses, man. Right. And skirts, man. And modest apparel. Right. Give a damn what anyone wants to screw up their face or not, man. Mm -hmm. Women dressing like men. Abomination, man. It's a That's right. It's destroyed, man. Not for dead. Yeah. Can't dress for them, yeah. <laughs> but just for the edification for the camera. Now. But I'm just going to bring out anyway, no matter what they say, man. Right. That's it. Bring out a John 15 and 10. God. If you keep my commandments. If you keep my what? If you keep, keep my, my commandments. commandments. We keep hearing about the commandments. We keep hearing about the commandments. But the Christian church said the commandments are done away with. So why is Christ saying if you keep my commandments? Read. You shall abide in my love. You shall abide in the Lord's love, man. We have to keep That's the commandments, right. man. To hell with the Christian church, man. Come out of that place, man. The dead hole, man. Read. Even I have, have I kept my father's commandments. Even I have to keep my father's commandments. I'm showing the difference between Christ and the heavenly father, man. Read. And abide in his love. And abide in his love, man. Read. These things have I spoken unto you. These things have I spoken unto you, man. This is written for our learning, man. The Lord spoke it unto us. Read. That my joy may. That my joy may. That my joy might remain in you. That my joy might remain in you, man. Wow. Righteousness. Brother in the high vis, you believe in the Lord? Yeah. You know we live in the last days? You don't know? Yeah, I know. What's your nationality? Where are you from, brother? I'm born here. Where you, uh, where's your dad from? Let's walk two minutes with you, brother. Yeah. Two minutes. You gotta go. You ain't got time. Yes. So in the last days, you tell the Lord you ain't got time, yeah? Please. This is James. Wait, 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 and that your joy might be full. And that your what? That, that your joy, joy might, might be full. I want our joy to be full, man. In abundance, man. In righteousness. Read. This is my commandment. This is my commandment. That ye love one another. And we have to love one another, especially our brothers, the Israelites, not all these other nations, not these heathens, only our own people. We love our own people. Read. As I have loved you. As the Lord have loved us, man. And this one they don't like us, man, because they know that the promises are for us. That's right. Read. Greater love have no man than this. Greater love have no man than this. Read. That a man lay down his life for his friends. That a man lay down his life for his friends, man. That's right. Look at this garbage. That's it, that. Bring it in. Sam. First Samuel chapter 2, verse 3. Bring it up. Talk no more exceedingly proudly. Talk no more what? Talk no, no, no more exceedingly, exceedingly proudly. Lord, ain't a proud man, man. You're a proud man. Don't be proud. Don't be yourself, man. Read. Let not arrogance come out of your mouth. Let not what? Let, Let not, not arrogance come, come out of your mouth. Don't be arrogant, man, is what the Lord's saying. Read. For the Lord is God of knowledge. For the Lord is God of knowledge, man. Right. If you want knowledge, pick up your Bible and read. Find out you're not a black man, you're not a black woman. You read. And by him actions are weighed. By him actions are what? And by, by him, him actions, actions are, are weighed. weighed. Actions are weighed, man. The Lord deals with a just balance, man. A false, a right. false balance is an abomination for the Lord, man. Read. This is James chapter 4 and verse 4. Uh -uh. Yeah. Ye adulterers and adulteresses, know ye not that the friendship of the world is enmity uh -huh. with Yahweh, whosoever Therefore, we'll be a friend of the world, 
He's an enemy of Yahweh. Hey, anyone who's a friend of this world is an enemy of Yahweh. Man. That's and right. We hate right. this world, man. You can't wait for this place to be destroyed, man. So let me get First John chapter two verse fifteen, and let me get Romans chapter two verse two. You got a question? So there's a smirking. Let me get Romans chapter uh, two verse two and First John chapter two verse fifteen. They can't. They can't believe that we come up here in you know, righteousness and order. They can't believe it. Yeah, you should answer yesterday. You're everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> We're everywhere, as Esau said, man. <laughs> 2 and 15. First John 2 and 15. Love not the world. I love not the world, the Lord said, because this world is a wicked place, man. Read. Neither the things that are in the Neither world. Neither the things that are in this world, man. Wickedness, man. Proud looks on people's faces, man. For what? They're nothing but dust and ashes, man. Read. If any man love the world, the love of the Father is not in him. If you love the world, the love of the Father is not in you, man. Right. This place is a pure vanity, man. They do the same thing week in and week out, man. And they don't pick up the book and read. They don't find out anything. This, this place is a mirage, man. It's a dream. Let me get For all that is in the world, the lust of the flesh and the lust of the eyes and the pride of life, it's not of the Father, but it's of the world. See, of the world. It's not of the Heavenly Father, it's of the world, man. And this world is wickedness, man. Vanity. Right? Do the same thing every day, day in and day out. You never get tired of it. Hoping to get something better. Read. And the world passes away. Mm -hmm. And the lust thereof. And the world but he passes that doeth the will of Yahweh. And the lust thereof, read. Abide it forever. And he that doeth the will of your hour, abide it forever, man. Because this place is going to pass right. away, man. Right. There will be no more, man. You want to be destroyed with it, or are you going to wake up and come back to the laws? The laws, statutes, and commandments, man. So, let's bring that. Up. Romans 12 and verse 2. And be ye not conformed to this world. Hey, we can't be conformed to this world, but what? But ye transformed. But be ye transformed. We have to tr be transformed, man. Read. By renewing of your mind. By renewing of the what? By, By renewing, renewing of, of your mind. mind. Renew your mind, man. Get your head right, man. Pick up a book and read. This is our history, man. Read. That ye may prove what is that good and acceptable and perfect will of God. We have to prove that good and acceptable will right. as possible. That we may prove that is good that and is acceptable and perfect will of God. And we are here to prove, man, righteousness right. That's before right. the Lord, not before man, man. That's right. Read. Is that enough? Hey, brother, going to prison. Yeah. This is wisdom of Solomon, chapter 18. Verse 15, thy mighty word leap down from heaven. Have a walk. Thy mighty word leap down, down from, from heaven. heaven. Out of thy royal throne as a fierce man of war. And the Lord's a man of war, man. Read. Into the midst of the land of destruction. Into the midst of the land of destruction, man. And it's a terrible thing to fall into the hands of the Lord, man. You have to keep the commandments. That's all right. You have to keep the commandments and live, man, for right. your own good. Let me get Jeremiah chapter two, verse ten. So coming up to that season, man, there's more and more and more. Are people gonna go out there and start digging out? <laughs> start to carry on, Tom. Go, carry. Verse sixteen. And brought thy unf unfringed commandment. As a sharp sword and standing up, filled with things, with death, and is touched with ev in ev touch the heaven, but it stood upon the earth. Come. Then suddenly, vision of horrible death, slap ya. vision of horrible dream, trouble them sore, and terror come upon, come upon them, and looking for. And one thrown here, and another here, half dead, showing the cause of his death. Far from the dream, far from the dream, that trouble them did 
for sure, for sure, this last day should should perish and not know why they were afflicted. See that the law can come to you in a dream, man. It's a terrible thing if the law comes to you in a dream, man. But if you get one of those visions or dreams, you better make moves. You better make moves, man. Whether you're a heathen or whether you're an Israelite, man. It didn't a law come to a dream when Abraham's wife was taken away from him. Right. And hey, that man gave him back his wife, man. So why have you troubled me, man? Yeah. And then Abraham said, hey, she is my sister, man. Yeah. She's my sister according to my father, but not according to my mother. Right. And he gave, hey, listen, man. Brothers, we've got to get in the book and read, man. And, and study for our learning. Because everything was written, was written for our learning, man. So let me get, um, before you get that, let me get Jeremiah. Jeremiah 10 yeah, and 2. Jeremiah chapter 2, verse 32. Come on, people, I've got the Lord, Can a maid forget her ornaments? He's asking the question now, can a maid forget her ornaments? Read. Or a bride or attire. Or a bride or attire. They're not going to forget that, man. That's where they come up for. A bride's going to look for her attire when she goes out there to get married. Read. Yet my people have forgotten me. Yet my people have what? Yet, Yet my, my people, people have forgotten me. They're out here calling out the lost sheep of the house of Israel, man. And they act like they forgot the Lord, man. They don't care. They're too wrapped up in this world, man. Read. Days without number. Days without number. People don't even pick up the book and read. The dust, cobwebs, and spiders crawling all over their Bibles. If they have Bibles, man. You don't pick up the book and read. You just go in the Christian church and let the pastor speak for five hours. Pay money and that's it. Sister, we're out here for you anyway. Come out, we're out here for you. Come here the word. That's a good thing you come up there asking questions. Read, is that your Actually, go on to trim it so why trim it so I want to see that. Sister, what's your nationality? You mean, sorry. Yeah, it's all right. We don't have to get your camera. What's your nationality, sister? No, no, sorry. I'm you believe in the Bible? You know we're living in the last days. Wow. Repent as an Israelite. <laughs> <laughs> Jeremiah 2 and verse 33. Let's go into that. Because our sisters, you can come out of this uh, say stuff, whether it's synthetic or whether it's horse hair, whatever they want to say. Or even, yeah, we're going to get to that. If you just preach it up, preach it up, that read. Jeremiah 2 and verse way, 33. Love, read. Why trimmest thou thy way to seek love? Why what? Why trimmest thou thy way, way to seek love? Why what? Why trimmest thou thy way to seek love? Why trimmest thou trim their way to seek love, man? They're going to burn their head to make it straight, to seek love, to get an interview, to get a job. To hell with that job, man. To hell with the friends you've got around you. You've got to straighten your hair and burn That's out your right. scalp. That's right. To seek love, man, and lose all your baby hairs and mash up your head, man. Your brain's at the top of your head. The Lord saying, why trim is that way to seek love? Have your natural hair out, man. Right. Serve the Lord, man, in righteousness. And hey, sister, we're not going at you. We're just seeking, we're just telling you love. Love yourself, right. sister, man. Look at Afro or set our locks, man. Jeez. Oh, yeah. Say that again for the top. Say that again for the top. <laughs> Jeremiah 2 and verse 33. Read. Why, why trimming start thy way to seek love? love? Why trimming your ways to seek love, man? That's like a man saying, cut off your beard and I hang around you. Uh, I'll give you a job if you cut off your beard. Hey, if that man say that I'm not cutting off my beard, I don't need that job, you know. I tell him, keep the money, I'm not cutting my beard, man. Make me like a man, like a lion, man. In it, brother, with a beard. You're right, in it, brother. You understand it? Go keep your beard, brother. Come on. Reef. Therefore, a sister with a rucksack. Sister with a rucksack. No, 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 no. We're out here for the Lord to tell you you're not a black woman. You're a daughter of Zion. Repent as an Israelite, not as a black woman. Read. That's right. Therefore, as thou also taught the wicked ones thy ways. Hey, they took the wicked one their ways, man. Long eyelashes, right. fake nails, man. They took the wicked ones their ways, man. That's not That's us. Right. Women don't need long eyelashes or fake Dude, nails, man. They're right. beautiful without that, man. And that's a compliment as well. Yeah, I know some woman wicked because the Lord give them eyelash, he give them and cut it off, and then put put on longer nail, yeah. longer eyelash. Why? Hey, why? No, 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 read this. This is Proverbs. Yeah, finish. Yeah, go, go, go. This is Proverbs chapter three, 
Verse 31. Every note not the oppressor. Every what? Every note not the oppressor. Every what? Every note not the oppressor. The Lord said, Don't envy the oppressor, man. The people that are oppressing you, don't envy them. No, read. I choose none of his ways. I choose none of their ways. I choose none of his ways. None of their ways, man. We don't envy the oppressor, man. We tell the women to love themselves. Keep your natural hair, man. Don't envy the oppressor, man. Right. Love yourself, man. The Lord made you already. And you want to run. Attachments onto it. Long nails. Extra long. I ain't gonna work it behind me. <laughs> That's right. Hey, listen, 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 listen. Ah. Hey, listen, let me get that. Hebrews chapter yeah, 4, verse 12. You mentioned that, man. Oh, yeah, yeah, go, go, go. Jeremiah 10 and 2. The priests are coming up. Read. Thus saith the Lord. Thus saith the Lord. This is what the Lord said. Read. Learn not the way of the heathen. Learn not the, the way of the heathen. Learn not the way of the heathen. The Lord said, don't learn the way of the heathen, man. Right. Why? Why? And be not dismayed at the signs of heaven. And don't be dismayed at the signs of heavens, man. We're going to see a lot of, um, we're going to see the red, uh, new moon red, a blood moon, Salakia, for weeks, for days coming up. Read. For the heathen are dismayed at them. For the what? For, for the, the heathen, heathen are dismayed at them. The heathen's going to be dismayed at that blood moon, man. You're going to see a right. You're going to see a blood moon. So the heathen's going to be dismayed at them. Read. For the customs of the people are vain. For the what? For, for the, the customs custom of, of the people are vain. The customs of these people are vain, man. Vanity, man. They pick up a tree and bow before it and put presents and tell them, Sack, I sent it. What type of. <laughs> Read. For one cut if a tree out of the forest. Hey, they cut the tree out of the forest and what? What do they do? <laughs> the work of the hands of the workmen. Read. With axe. Read. They deck it with silver and, and they gold. Deck, they deck that Christmas tree with silver and gold, man. <laughs> they fasten it with nails and, and they hold it tight with nails and hammers, man. <laughs> that that it move not. That it move not, man. They are upright as a palm tree. They are upright as a palm tree, man. Some of them you even get out a tree. They get a fresh tree and cut it out. And they worship the, they worship the tree when they put the presents under it. Read. But speak not. Hey, the trees can't speak, man. Read. They must need be born. They must need be born, read. Because they cannot go. They can't move anywhere. Okay. They just fall. Read. Be not afraid of them. The Lord said, don't be afraid of them. That's right. For they cannot do evil. They cannot do evil, read. That's right. Evil read. also is it in them to do good. And it's not in them to do good, man. Because imagine come out of your holy land, you know, and you're seeing someone with a tree and decking it. You might think it's a, a false god that might pick up and start walking and talking because they're decking it with silver. It's another false idol, well, well, a right. false god. They're celebrating Nimrod's birthday, man. We don't celebrate Christmas, man. That's an evil day, man. That's right. And the Lord said, learn not the way of the heathen. Bring out a prison. Bring out a prison. Psalms 119, verse 33. Bring it up. Teach me, O oh Lord. The way of thy statutes. We're asking the Lord to teach us, man, the way of his statutes. That's right. right. The and I shall keep it in, unto the end. And we shall keep it unto the end. The law was written for our learning, man. Everything was written for our learning. Pick up your book and read, man. Read. Give me understanding, and I shall keep thy law. And we're asking the Lord to give us understanding to That's keep right. his law, man. Today's a Sabbath day, sisters. Don't buy and don't sell. That's right. Sunday's not the Sabbath day, man. Read. That's right. Teach yeah, up. yeah, I shall observe it with my whole heart. And we shall observe it with our whole heart, man. Make me to go in the path of thy commandments, okay. for therein do I do, do delight. And there That's do right. Delight, man, the Lord commands, man. Read. Incline my heart unto thy testimony, and not to comfort so, the Turn away mine eyes. <laughs> Turn away mine eyes. They find the camera. Beholding and vanity. Out. Get on the cameras, man. From beholding what? From beholding vanity. Hey, from beholding vanity, man. That's right. That's it. Hold it up. What's your nationality, brother? You believe in the Bible? Of course I believe in the Bible, but I'm Jamaican. Yes, brother. What does Jamaican mean? What do you mean? I'm from it? Jamaica. Yes. Jamaica, let me just say it. Jamaica means wood and water, brother. Oh, okay. We can't be wood and water, brother. No. They renamed us that and called us Jamaican. Where was he before Jamaica? Back in two years now. Where? Back in Africa. Africa. Yeah. Well, where was he before Africa? Because that's not our homeland. We yeah. fled into Africa in 78 AD from Roman persecution, brother. We're the Israelites, the Hebrew Israelites. Yeah, but no. You know about the Hebrew Israelites? You know about the Hebrew Israelites. You, know. you heard about them, yeah? yeah? No. And that's who we are, brother. You are our brother. We're calling in the lost All sheep. All the way man. from the Maroons. You know everything. We're calling in the lost sheep, sheep brother. So, what do we have to do? Let me get James 1 and 2 too. No marker, no beast. No, no, no beast. And who's this man, brother? Who's this man, brother? No Who's this man here, brother? 
And them people, and them people. So, brother, let us, let us give some couple scriptures, couple bread and water with you. So, may I work right now? You know, today's a Sabbath day, we're not meant to be working. Next week, try not work on Saturday. For real, I true. You got a YouTube channel before you do that. That's true. And if yeah. you got flyers, if you got a pocket, if you got a pocket. No pocket. No pocket. 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 My pocket. Oh, block. Okay, say no more about it. Say no more about it. Say no more about it. Every week we're at it Saturday. Shalom. Peace of blessing. Peace of blessing. See that we're calling our people, man. The lost sheep and the Islam, man. And it's a, it's a righteous thing. The brother circle back quick time to hear the word quick. And find out who. With the Israelites. Say me no, me no, me no. With the Israelites, man. He's like one, Superman, man. 119 and verse. You see that? 36. Bring it out. Incline my heart unto thy testimony. Incline what? Incline my heart unto thy testimony. Ask the Lord to incline our mind unto his testimony. That's right. And not to covetousness. And not to covetousness, that's man. Right. Not Eat. to covet another man's wife, another man's uh, a bag, another man's. That's no, right. that's evil. We are not right. into that. Sisters, right. come here the word that's of the right. Lord. Here, We're living in the last days. Today's a Sabbath day. Don't spend, don't buy. Read. Turn away <laughs> my eyes from <laughs> beholding vanity. Turn away my eyes from beholding what? Turn, Turn away, away my eyes, eyes from beholding vanity. vanity. Brother, hey, listen, what's your nationality? Where are you from? Moroccan. Moroccan. African. African. Where were you before that? How did you get to Morocco? Morocco. How did you get there? Explain. How did you get to Morocco? Your people get to Morocco. You weren't originally in Morocco. Oh, right. Um, Arab, you're Arab, right? So you're from Yemen. How did the Yemen get to North Africa? Uh, your forefather will be from Ishmael. You know Ishmael? You know Ishmael. That will be your forefather. Ishmael. Come up, come up, we're not going to Come up, we're not going to bite, man. <laughs> so your, your, your forefather will be from Ishmael. You know, Abraham had two sons. He had Isaac and he had Ishmael. Your child is not the, ch the children of the, um, of the... Let me get Galatians 4 and 30. Yeah, well, Your well, forefather well, was, was, yeah, yeah, was sent away with the Hagar, the uh, Hagar, was it a maid servant? This is Galatians chapter 4, verse 30. <laughs> Nevertheless, that says the scripture. And that says the scripture in Genesis. He's repeating that in the New, New Testament. Read. Cast out the bond woman. Cast out the bond woman, the slave woman, Hagar, your foremother. Read. And her son. And her son. Who is her son? Ishmael. Right. Read. For. Let the scripture finish. We're going to get that. For the son of the bond woman. For shall, the son of the bond woman, Ishmael. Shall not. Shall what? Shall not be here. You want to be heir. With the son of of the free woman. And we're the son of the free woman. You won't be heir with us. You'll be cast out. Right. Is what the Lord said. Right. Well, let's oh, get You're heathen. You're going to be under us in the kingdom. When this world gets destroyed, because you know Egypt, the Pharaoh, they went down. This place, Babylon, means confusion land. This place is going to go down. You're going to be under us serving the Lord. Babylon means confusion land or land of confusion. God. This is the book of Romans, chapter 9, verse 7. It says, Neither because they are the seed of Abraham are they children, are children, but in Isaac shall thy seed be called. In Isaac shall the seed be called. You are the children of Abraham, but it says, Neither because they are the seed of Abraham. This, this, this is that they are the children of the flesh. You're the children of the flesh. These are not the children of God. These are not the children of God. Because the children of God went through this. The right. children of God don't know who they are. They don't know that they're Hebrews, the real Jews. The children of Greek. But the children of the promise are born for the seed. And we're counting for the seed, the children of the promise. That's be very deep, brother. It's not that deep. It's quick. It's quick to understand. It's not hard. Do you know your Ishmael, Read. For this is the word of promise. This is the word of promise. At this time will I come. And Sarah shall have a son. And we know Sarah had a son. Read. And not only this, but when Rebekah also had received by one, by one, by one, by our father Isaac, for the children be not yet born, neither have done anything. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's it on that. Yeah. So you're, you're the children of the heathen. You know who you are. Most of our people up here don't know who they are. So we're out for our people, the Israelites that call themselves Jamaican, Nigerian, all these bad words. It wasn't called that before. They wasn't calling themselves that before. Right. But we've sinned against the Lord and we're just showing you, look, when everything's said and done, you're going to be under us, serving the Lord God. 
of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Serving the Lord is better. Yeah, but you're going to serve under us in bondage because you had our people in slavery at a certain time as well. Was it the Saharan slave trade? Yeah, Saharan slave trade. Saharan slave trade. You benefited off slavery. Yes, you did. Yes, you did. The Sub Saharan slave trade. Google it. Go and Google it now. Sub Saharan slave trade. No, 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 no. In here, I know with the Moroccan history. We had a big relation with, with Mauritania and Ethiopian. Yeah, and there was we're not the state. Ethiopians then. Yeah. We're not the Ethiopians. We came down from, from Ethiopia. No, we didn't come down from Ethiopia. I think you did. No, no, no. We told you at the Bible we didn't. <laughs> this is the book of Ezekiel. This is the book. This is the book of Ezekiel, chapter thirty-nine, verse twenty-three. And he then shall know that the house of Israel went into captivity for the iniquity because they trespassed against me. Therefore, I hid my face from them and give them into the hands of their enemies. So they fell, they all by the sword. And we fell by the sword for our iniquities, man. Hello, hello. We fell by the sword, man. So he's saying, he's saying that his people didn't have our people in captivity. Hey, all the nations had our people in captivity, man. Right. This is our seventh captivity, man, the last one, man. Right. We had enough of this place, man. So we're waking up our people, man, to come out of this dead state of mind. Let them know today's the Sabbath day. Don't spend, don't buy, don't trade. Sisters, the light blue and the dark blue. Let us hold one scripture for that. One scripture. You see that? You separate from your friend. Bring out a piece of Don't buy on the Sabbath. Psalms 19 and 7. Bring it out. The law of the Lord is perfect. The law of the Lord is what? The law of the Lord is perfect. Hey, this law is perfect, man. Get understanding and understand it if you don't understand. Ask a brother to teach you, man. If you don't understand certain scriptures. Right. The book is about the Israelites, man, not about everyone else. Not everyone can be saved. Right. A lot of you are doomed for destruction. You That's and your children. Right. right. Read. Converting the soul. Converting the what? Converting, Converting the soul. Converting the soul, man. Read. The testimony of the Lord is sure. The testimony of the Lord is sure. Right. We're sure of it, man. Making wise the simple. Making wise the simple. That's simple. Right. Man here, man. Meek man up here, man. We didn't know who we were before. Read. The statutes of the Lord are right. The statutes of the Lord are right. Rejoice in the heart. Rejoice in the heart. The mind will rejoice, man. Every day waking up knowing who we, we know who we are, man. Hitch. Knowing this place will see me destroyed, yeah, yeah. man. See the heathen smiling one minute, they got a sad face the next. Right. They see us up here in righteousness, man. Right. They rather us up in playing football. Right. Read. <laughs> the commandments of the Lord is pure. The commandments of the Lord is pure, man. Enlightening the eyes. Enlightening the eyes. We wake up. We can see now, man. The wickedness of the people. They don't like us. We don't right. like them either. Right. Read. Right. The fear of the Lord is clean. The fear of the Lord is what? The fear of the Lord is clean. He's clean. The fear of the Lord, man. Read. Enduring forever. Enduring for what? Enduring, Enduring forever. forever. Enduring for what? Enduring, Enduring forever. forever. Enduring forever, man. Read. The judgments of the Lord are true. Judgment of the Lord are true. And righteous all together. Righteous all together. This is the book of Proverbs. This is the book of Proverbs. This is the book of Proverbs. Chapter 10 and verse 6. Bring it up. Blessings are upon the head of the just. Hey, blessings are upon the head of the just, man. That's right. A mighty precept. We've got our children right. out here, man, preaching the word of the Lord. Why? Because we can see the signs. We know Bring the place can be destroyed. We're out here for our people, man. Tell them, wake That's up. Right. Today's That's a Sabbath right. day. Don't spend on a Sabbath day, man. Wake up before it's too late. Read. But violence covering the mouth of the wicked. Hey, violence covereth the mouth of the wicked. Uh, read that That's again. Right. Bring that again for the top. <laughs> a mighty precept. Proverbs 10 and 6. This is the book of Proverbs, chapter 10, verse 6. Bring up. Blessings are upon the head of the just. Blessings are upon the head of the just, That's man. That's right. But just but men. But what? But violence covers the mouth of the wicked. But violence, violence covers the mouth of the wicked, wicked, man. The wicked people, man. Violence covers their mouth. That's, That's right. They can speak about violence, man. Read. No, no, okay, my, that was mighty precept. You got a young prince that is spreading the word, man. You can be doing anything on a Saturday. Table tennis, karate, football. But they're out here doing the Lord's word, man. Doing the Lord's work. Let me get the precept. We got a precept down here, man. It says, 
This is the book of Joel, chapter 2, verse 28. And it shall come to pass afterwards that I will pour out my spirit upon all flesh, and your sons and your daughter shall prophesy. Your whole man shall dream dreams. Your young man shall see vision. Young children, young children, young sons, young daughters, prophesy, bring out mighty precepts, man. That's right. Mighty precepts. The old men shall see dream dreams and see visions, man. In the last days, we're going to